Hi guys, this is Chatan Bindal. Welcome to our new series of digital marketing in which we will learn about Twitter. So in this section, we will learn about Twitter, Twitter handling, sign up of account, how to maintain basic etiquettes and basic definitions, then hashtags, trends, then how to create trends. What are the basic techniques to improve your profile, then increase followers and then paid marketing on Twitter and list also in between. So let's start with this. What is Twitter and how it is different from other social media network and how similar it is with other social media network, especially with Facebook. And we will compare this with Facebook so that those who are new to Twitter and who know a very little about Twitter can make uh, it is easy for them to understand. So what is Twitter? Another social media platform where you can uh, tweet. Now, what is tweet and uh, uh, what is the limitation of tweets? Tweet, uh, like in Facebook, you have post. Whatever you, uh, you, you write on your Facebook wall, that is post. Similarly here, whatever you write on the Twitter wall, that is known as tweet. With tweet, there is a limitation that you can write only 280 characters, not more than that. Earlier, that limit was 140. Recently, in last year quarter, they have increased this limit. So this is what Twitter is. Second point, there are millions of people and organizations and businesses are using Twitter. If you look at this number, there are approximately more than uh, 300 million people are active users who send more than 5 million tweets per day. And this data is almost uh, one year earlier. So this number must be double right now. Okay, so it might be 100 mil, uh, 8, 600 billion or 700 billion active users. Now, why should I use Twitter? Because most of the people wants to know why you should use Twitter. First thing is immediate connections. As it is more of a public platform. It's not a private kind of platform. It is more public platform. Where you can engage, you can talk to anyone without having consent to him. Like you can tag somebody in your post you need not to add him or you need uh, he should not follow you or you should not follow him you can converse start the conversation with anyone anywhere on twitter you need not to be connected with them so that's why i say immediate connections there are no apps groups pages nothing like that so just conversations are going on so it's very easy Third is no barriers to engage in relationship. As I earlier said, as there is no foundation, it's more public network. So anyone can tag anyone and put his name. Fourth, it's a great way to know people. And this is what Twitter works on. If you know how to use it, then this is the only line that can make you understand. I tell you why but before that coming into that story that rule that is 10 is to 1 uh, that I will discuss in the next section first let's understand what is other things are there in Twitter what can Twitter do for my organization provide a way to receive feedbacks traffic direct to your project or to your website Third, provide information about your work, what you are doing. Connect you to the your target audience, means whom you want to reach exactly. And fifth, raise awareness about your campaigns, whether it's a marketing campaign or it's a public campaign or it's it could be a voluntary campaign. So you can raise awareness about your organization, about your campaigns. Now next, how Twitter is different from Facebook? It is more immediate. You tag someone, it is so fast. People are so active that they reply you very fast. 
second more newsy it create trends so when it create trends it's become newsy you uh, you get everything on twitter at that point of time which is running on tv channels any newspaper and it is the same thing running on twitter fourth more concise as the tweet size is very limited as the tweet size is very limited that is 280 characters so it is more concise people give exact information and you get the crisps of that whole conversation and you get the idea fourth point better for finding out information about you so what do you think what kind of person you are or what kind of organization is that uh, you can easily uh, gain it by reading out the tweets and fifth barely very few barriers to entry it's like very open platform as i said it earlier now how to join we will learn in next video bye bye see you